Hey guys, David the Fish and Pastor here, and this is a video I've been wanting to make for a little while. Um, if you're like me, you love fishing, you have a passion for fishing, but you understand that it can actually get pretty expensive with rods, with reels, with line, with lures. It really adds up. And so I just want to share with you five easy ways that you can uh, save money on your fishing gear without having to really compromise the quality of your gear. So hopefully this helps you uh, and hopefully you enjoy this video. Okay guys, so um, for this first one, this is a, a really easy one to do. In fact, all five of these are very, very easy to do. And uh, maybe, maybe you guys already do these uh, and maybe you do different things. And if you do, um, I'd love to hear about them. I'd love to know what they are. Leave them in the comments section below. Um, and what I'm also going to do is leave a description of the different things I talk about. Uh, if I can still find the links and stuff, I'll put them in the description below as well. But the first one um, is, is really just joining mailing and email lists uh, for different stores that sell tackle. So be it Bass Pro Shops, uh, outdoor pro shops, Cabela's, whatever, wherever you are um, buying your fishing gear from, joining those email lists uh, is something you kind of have to endure uh, in order to find the good deals because you do get a lot of emails um, of, of different sales. And most of the sales I'm not really interested in. They're, you know, kind of normal things. Uh, but there are some sales that come along every once in a while that are just too good to pass up. And, and a good example actually... Uh, recently happened. I I'm, I have e I'm on email list for for different stores, and one of them is actually Dick's Sporting Goods, which I don't get a lot of gear from because it's actually kind of pricey. Um, but again, every once in a while you do find these fantastic, fantastic deals, and they actually had this deal for the uh, Jackal Gantarell Junior um, on sale. And these actually retail, the, the juniors retail for $31.99 each. Um, but they had the sale that if you buy two of them, they were selling them for $10 each. So instead of paying over $60 for two, I paid 20 bucks for two. Um, that is a fantastic, fantastic deal. In fact, if you go on their website now, they don't even have them on the website because I'm pretty certain they completely, completely sold out. But again, you do have to sift through catalogs and emails and sale flyers and all this stuff. Um, but every once in a while, you do find these fantastic, fantastic deals that are really too good to pass up. And now I have two Jack O'Gantarell Juniors that I only paid 20 bucks for uh, instead of over $60 for. Um, so that that's a that's a real easy one to do. Whatever stores you're shopping at, uh, even the ones you may not think are the best. Again, like like a Dick's Sporting Goods, who is generally a little bit more pricey than than some other places. Um, maybe not always. Maybe I'm wrong, but just from my experience, it's usually a little bit higher. Um, but again, you just never know where you're going to find those deals. So that's the first one, and that's a real easy one. You do kind of have to endure it a little bit. Um, but that's just a real simple way uh, to save some money on some fishing gear. Not just lures, but rods and reels, and I've gotten some there as well too. So a uh, really easy way. So let's go on to the second one. Okay, so the second one um, is when you actually go to, your, to, to the stores to buy your gear or online or wherever, uh, a really great thing to do is to join their rewards program if, if they have one. Um, because you're you're pretty much um, kind of getting paid to shop there in, in a sense, you know. So you know if it's if it's uh, Bass Pro or again Outdoor Pro Shop, those are kind of the ones that I really do. Tackle Warehouse. I don't know if they have an, a rewards program, but um, uh, it's a really great way so that every time and you know Dick Sporting Goods too. And I'm not affiliated with any of these companies. I'm just saying these are different tackle shops. Um, but it's a really, really easy way. You just join the rewards program. Every time you make a purchase, you put in your number or they scan your card or whatever, and you, you, you build these points. And then after some time, you can actually redeem these points um, for lures. And, and I've done that. I've, I've gotten, you know, 
you get ten dollars or 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 twenty bucks or whatever it is because I've spent so much money at this store that now you know sure I've spent the money but I I, I already planned on spending the money now I can just kind of get rewarded for it and then go back and use those points to get more lures uh, and it's just a really really simple way if you're gonna shop there anyways you might as well take advantage of that and and be on their rewards program so that's another uh, real simple one um, and and get on as many rewards programs as you can you know whenever you do shop there even if you shop there only every once in a while every time you go put some some points on your rewards and just build that up over time and usually there's not a time limit usually um, you know there's not you don't have to get a certain amount of points in a certain amount of time it's just the the building up of points so that's a really um, really simple one there Okay, and so for the third one, um, this one's this one's a little bit different, and some of you may be a little bit hesitant about this one um, because we love our brands, we love brand names, uh, whatever that is, you know, Shimano, Abu Garcia, whatever it is, and, and I'll tell you, I'm one that I I, I do like brand name things. Um, I just I know I can rely on the company; they're gonna. Um, have these guarantees you just know it's it's legit right um but sometimes you can actually find inexpensive gear from from companies um that you just kind of either you never heard of or you never thought of and uh i recently came into a company um uh, and had this kind of situation where they actually got a hold of me it was a company that i had heard that i had heard of already uh but i had never bought any gear it, it was intriguing because they had inexpensive gear um, and, and, and here's, here's another key to this is always, always, always read reviews or watch reviews on YouTube or whatever it is of gear. Um, never just buy it just because it's inexpensive. Cause sometimes you will get what you pay for. <laughs> if you go cheap, you're going to get some gear that's not made as well. But if you go and you read reviews and, and I've done this with rods and with reels and, uh, especially lately with this company, uh, casking, um, they make some really, really fantastic gear, uh, and it's really inexpensive. Um, and it, it's not, and I'll tell you, um, it, it's really fantastic gear. They sent over a reel. I tested it with some line and it's really, really good stuff. And it's super, super cheap. This right here, I did a, a video review and I'll put that on link below so you can watch that and I'll put it where you can uh, put the link where you can go get it yourself but this is the the cast King speed demon it's a nine three to one reel um, and it's 69.99 which is ridiculous uh, it's ridiculously cheap and it's a fantastic reel uh, I did a personal review on it for cast King um, and I've watched other people do reviews on them and they are really really great reels they're built well the line is really fantastic and it's dirt cheap honestly um, so I would never go out and just buy something cheap just because it's cheap I want to know that I'm, I'm, I'm gonna spend my money even if it's not a lot of money um, I want to know that I'm spending my money well. I'm not just throwing it away. So, you know, sure, we love our Shimanos and sure, we love our Abus and all that stuff. But sometimes you can find some really fantastic gear uh, at some really fantastic prices, um, you know, and going on. And, and, and I've done it reviews for um, some rods and things like that. And it's just really, really great. Um, and honestly, I have no complaints about it. Uh, you would think that, oh, there's something wrong with it because it's cheaper stuff, but you'd be surprised at how well um, this stuff is made. And so, again, I'll put the links in the description below so that you can go and see it for yourself. I'll put the link to the video so you can see it yourself. Um, but it's it's really good stuff, and, and you're not compromising quality uh, just to save some money. You're getting quality products uh, at great, great prices. And again, if you're an angler on a budget and you don't have... 400 bucks to spend on a reel. I don't have $400. If I even thought about spending that kind of money on a reel, my wife would kill me. Um, <laughs> and so, you know, a 69.99 reel, it, it's it's under $100 and it's really well made. This line, this is a spool of um, 327 yards and I think they go for like 15 bucks or something like that and it's great line so again 
you don't have to compromise quality in order to get or yeah in order in order to um get it for 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 a low price and uh casking is a a really great example of a quality product uh, at a low price so that's that one let's move on to number four okay so number four um and, and again I wouldn't be telling you guys this if I didn't do it myself, if I didn't believe in it, if um, I didn't think that it was going to benefit you. I'm not making this video for the sake of making this video. I, I genuinely want to help you save some money. So anything I say here, um, whether I'm affiliated or not, weighs not on, on what I'm saying. It, it, it's really just about uh, getting you really great things. Um, for a cheap price because because we love fishing we're passionate about fishing but again it can get expensive so let me just quickly move on to um, number four and that's to subscribe to a, a monthly fishing subscription box whether that's LTB MTB whatever box um, again I'm not affiliated with the, with that company I just really like getting lures <laughs> I, I i love love lures i have more lures than uh, I, I can probably fish um to be honest i, I have i have uh, this is my uh this is my crankbait box and i have more crankbaits in here than i'm probably going to need for a while and i still get more because i love lures and uh, you know a subscription box like Lucky Tackle Box or or Mystery Tackle Box or again whatever you choose um, you think is best. I happen to do Lucky Tackle Box. There are things about it that I like personally, um, things that attract me to the company, and and again um, I just I'd recommend it not because I'm affiliated with them, but just because I think it's a great product. But it's a great way to get. Um, more lures for your money because you pay 15 to 25 bucks I think it is depending on the box and you always get more in the box than what you're paying for um, you know 30 to 40 bucks worth of lures for 20 you know 25 to 15 bucks and it's a, it's a great way to get stuff you've never fished before get stuff from companies you've never heard of before and just try out new things um, and, and again if you you budget right and, and you can um, afford to get it or just try one and then and then if you don't like it you can stop it um, or you can just pay for the whole year or whatever uh, whatever works for you but but that's just that's a really easy way to get especially if you love lures that's a really really easy way to get uh, some some fishing tackle and some lures for less money and you get really good stuff too I mean they'll, they'll put in Gosh, they'll put in Lucky Craft and live target things, and you know it, it's not like cheap stuff. It's it's really good stuff. So um, I know I've gotten some really great baits, and I'm not complaining. Not not every single bait is great. Not every single bait is one that I'm super excited about. There's some that I'm like, eh, you know. But there are some that that I just know are going to be really really good, and uh, that's that's a really fantastic way. So just subscribing to a you know a monthly box. Um, is another easy way. And so let me share with you guys the fifth and last one. Okay, so the fifth and final one um, is, is uh, this really goes for all shopping, not just, not just fishing stuff, but is to always check the clearance section. Um, and maybe you do this every time. I know I do this every single time I go on a website, uh, Tackle Warehouse, Bass Pro, Outdoor Pro Shop, whatever. I'm always checking the clearance section because there's always stuff on its way out. Either uh, the item's been discontinued, um, there's a new line coming in, and they want to push that out. What, whatever it is, it's a great way um, to, to get some great gear for, for cheap. Um, and again, always read reviews. Make sure you know you're you're you're, you're spending wisely and um, that that you're you're getting a good product for the money just because it's cheap doesn't mean it's great but you can find great things for for less money and we've talked about that already um, you know and, and just really going on and, and looking around and I've found I have found great rods and um, 
great lures that they're just they're just continuing or whatever it is and they're marking down that price because they have to get it out stores have to get that inventory out to make room for a new product uh, because otherwise it's it's space and they're paying for that space so they just want to kind of get it out so that's another uh, real easy way and every time you go you know online uh, don't be afraid to click that red clearance uh, section because there's always usually usually not always but usually um, some really great product on its way out so that's just five things that that I do personally to, to, to try to save money again I'm an angler on a budget I, I don't have um, a ton of money to be spending on fishing gear um, but I you know I have I have multiple rod and reel setups I've been able to um, kind of find again find some great deals try to be a good steward of what i have shop wisely and i've been able to put together some 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 in my opinion some pretty decent setups that are specific for cranking for frogging for whatever it is uh, and i've done it without spending a ton of money um but but there are times and this is just kind of a little bonus thing there are times when you just have to spend the money uh, there are times when it is more beneficial in the long term to put more money into whatever it is you're investing it because the product is better um and and there's just times when that's inevitable just you're gonna have to spend the money save up uh put it aside whatever you have to do just again be wise about it um and make sure it's it's worth it uh, but if it's worth it it's worth it you know and, and there's just times when you you just you have to you have to spend the money um, and that's okay. That's okay. It's just, I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend doing that all the time. There's other solutions. We've just talked about five of them that you can, um, uh, use. And, and again, if you have any others that, that I'm not using, and obviously there's, I'm sure a ton of more ways to save money, but if you have any ideas, you do something that, uh, I didn't talk about here. Um, I'd love, love to hear about it and just have a conversation and uh, just see, just see what your what your thoughts are on uh, on saving money. But uh, again, I'm gonna leak all the stuff below. Lucky Tackle Box. If you actually want five dollars off your first box, if you're not subscribed yet, I'm gonna put a link down below. Your first box, five bucks off. So um, you know, if if you're getting the regular box, you'll be getting it for ten bucks instead of fifteen bucks. If you're getting the uh, XL box, you get it for twenty bucks instead of twenty-five bucks. So you're saving even more money, and it'll help me out as well. Um, so click on that link if you're interested in Lucky Tackle Box. Uh, if you're interested in casking, uh, again, I'll put the links below. And um, uh, I I'm recommending them um, because they're they're a great company and they're a great product. Um, but I, I will, I, I want to be honest with you guys because I don't want you to think that, um, I'm being dishonest in, in any single, in, in any way I, I am uh, officially, officially a, uh, a cast King ambassador. Uh, so I'm, I'm now uh, more than partnering with the company. I'm, I'm an ambassador for the company, but I'm not sharing it because I want to look good in front of them. I'm, I'm sharing it because I believe in the product because, um, I wouldn't recommend it to you unless it were a great product and I wouldn't be partnering with them or be an ambassador unless I thought it was worth it and they were a good company with a good product. So um, again, I'll put all the links below and uh, if, if you're interested or if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to have a conversation. I'd love to answer any questions that you may have. Um, uh, if you're going to ask me if I would be willing to sell you a Gantrell Jr., uh, the answer is no. <laughs> I'm keeping both of them. Uh, I'm really looking forward to fishing them. Actually, I'm probably going to take them out tomorrow and fish them. Um, but again, if you have any questions, let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really, really appreciate you guys. Uh, I'm really close to hitting 600 subscribers. It's going to happen in the next couple days, I'm sure. And uh, once we get to 1,000, once we get to 1,000, I'm going to do a giveaway. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but I'm really looking forward to it. So thanks again for everything. God bless. I hope this helps you out. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I uh, hope you catch lots and lots of fish. Remember to pray, fish, and repeat. God bless you guys. I'll see you later.